Alright, what is going on, buddy? Welcome back here today to another NBA 2K19 My League uh, Scenario Trade Rebuild. And today, it is going to be a John Wall match. So, there's very few teams in real life that are in a desperate need for a point guard. And there's even fewer teams that would be willing to probably take on John Wall's massive contract. So, I just made a, a cool, fun trade here. Uh, I traded our pick in this year's draft. I did some wait a season. They ended up with the 12th pick. So, I gave up the 12th pick. Evan 48, Melvin Frazier, who's 22, uh, the earliest second round pick we had, which I believe was pick five, and then also our pick next year, top five protected. Uh, that all went to the Wizards for just John Wall straight up. So yeah, we just added John Wall to pair up with Jonathan Isaac, uh, Melvin Gordon, and Mo Bamba. I'm actually going to try to make this a realistic rebuild from now on. Like, I'm not going to be doing fantasy style moves. So, Vucevic, unfortunately, is probably going to be gone. We're going to go, we're going to roll in the direction of Mo Bamba. Uh, like I said, I traded my picks, so we just have two second round picks here, uh, which I'm not even going to bother drafting. Uh, so let's just see who we ended up. Jerry Foster and Frank Howard. We'll sign both of them. They might be cut. They might never even play for us. Uh, Jonathan Simmons, I think I'm actually going to bring back. Just because I don't really see this being a big play for free agents. And I would not mind him as a backup wing option. Or he might even start at the two, honestly, if we can't find something better. So, Jerome Martin, not going to bring back. Jerry Grant, I wouldn't mind him as a backup. But we already have uh, DJ Augustine on roster. So, it's not worth it. We only currently really have... Well, I guess John Wall is obviously a bad contract, technically. Uh, but if you guys want to see any more trade scenario rebuilds, let me know in the comments. A team and player you guys would want to see that... Like, there's a rumor that could happen or something that could happen in the offseason or at the trade deadline. Let me know. Uh, Mozgov, we're still paying 16 mil for it. I believe it's one year left on his deal. I really hope it's not two with a player option. That would suck. Okay. One year left, and he's gone. So, let's see here. Uh, I don't... Well, free agency. Let me see how many guys I currently can throw out there. One, two, three, four, uh, maybe five, six, seven, I guess eight. Mozgov will be the backup center. So I do want a backup wing player. Uh, JJ Redick would be really cool, but he's 35. Jeremy Lamb would also be pretty cool. I might give him like a one and one. He could even start for us. Bring Terrence Ross back is an option. He's actually playing really well in real life. Tyreek Evans only demanding 6.6 .6 mil. I gotta hop on that. I gotta hop on that. That's a steal. Especially if you come off the bench. So I would give him a three-year deal worth 20 mil. Even a player option at the end of it. Yeah, let's give him that. Uh, I don't know if he would be our... Or that would be his number one deal. If not, then we'll... Okay. Now, nah, looks like we're gonna be picking up him, which is nice. He's 29. Uh, two years older than Lamb. But a little bit cheaper, which is sweet. So we do pick up Tyreek Evans. We're gonna renounce the rights on everybody here, including Nikola Vucevic. We'll keep an eye on what team besides him uh he has zero offers as of now uh, okay so let me let me sign tyreek and then we'll see what we want to do now so we have one two three four five six seven eight i think i would want to back up small forward and upgrade over wesley would do a reason would be interesting yeah you know we'll pair up john wall and Ariza in in uh Orlando so we'll give him the most we can which is 8.26 uh, mil for one year he signs with that he's probably gonna regress a little bit but that's why I only gave him a one-year deal Joyce Randall damn he's not gonna take that long deal from the Jazz I mean he's getting more annually no he's gonna he would get more annually from the Jazz here wow interesting he's devoted to New Orleans uh, nobody is offering Vucevic a deal which is quite actually now uh, looks like Dallas is gonna hop on the Vucevic sweepstakes four year 116 mil so a little bit over 25 mil, which is a lot of money. They chose him over DJ. And I just want to see. Yep, he signed that. 27 mil annually. A lot of money. I'll see you guys at training camps. All right, guys. So training camps, I'm going to be sending, I think, untapped potential to both Bamba and Isaac. I mean, Isaac in this game usually doesn't turn out to be like a real like stud uh, for the eighth overall pick or fifth overall pick. What was he? Fifth or sixth? He was 6th in 2017. I don't know, though. If you can put up that stat line, like, I would love that. But I feel like it's going to be more like that. But we'll see. So we have the starting five figured out. Wall, Evans, uh, Isaac, Gordon, Baba. Really good defensive lineup with Wall, Isaac, and Baba out there. All right. So Simmons is most definitely going to be the 6th man. I would actually rather reason with the 7th man. Mozgov, you can get, like, 16 a night. DJ, you can get, like... 12 a night because we're going to be paying job playing job wall heavy minutes we'll go with that uh okay so baba you're gonna get 32 aaron gordon 34 
Uh, John Wall 37 they want to go. Okay, I want to go 34 to him too, and then we'll go 31. So that we'll clear it out at this. I will see you guys at the end of the uh, season number one. We do have our pick if it lands in the top five. If not, it goes to Washington. And let's see how our new all-star point guard can do in a first full year in a Magic uniform. All right, I'm not going to call this a disappointing season. I mean, we're in the Eastern Conference, so we still can make the playoffs. But a very subpar 500 year for us with our first full year with John Wall and such. I mean, we're going to have a little bit more creativity in the offseason with Mozgov, Jonathan Simmons, and... Uh, Moskov Simmons and Augustine's contract's up. That's like 28 mil freed up. But John Wall's contract does take an increase. Um, and Isaac might be a restricted free agent. No, 2015 free agents are. And I'm pretty sure... I don't even remember who their 2015 free uh, draft pick was. Was it Payton? I think it was Alfred Payton. So, no, that was 2014. That was the year of Wiggins. Who was their 20... Oh, it was Azonia. Yeah, we know how that went. All right, so, yeah, I don't think we have a restricted free agent then. So, any magic? Are we going to get John Wall? Maybe. That'd be cool. No. No magic. All right. We do get John Wall on all defensive first team. Average 21, 7.8, and 1.9. That's solid. I mean, that's really good. I don't know if that is... Oh, Jesus. Some, the 38 mil a year solid. It goes up to 41, so it takes a 3 mil increase. That's a lot of money. Uh, no magic here. I mean, did the Wizards... Ooh! No way! No way! Cam Reddish fell to 12. This was the pick we gave them. Wow, they turned John Wall to Cam Reddish. Okay, that's looking like a steal for them. We ended up being a 7 seed. Okay, so we could maybe make a run if we get lucky. We're taking on Boston in round one. Kyrie Smart, Tatum, Hayward, Horford, Brown, Jesus Christ. Very good squad. Who was their first round pick? Langford. They got him at 9. I guess, okay, so the Kings had him at 9, which is actually kind of... Kind of cool. I'd rather not see them in the top five. Uh, Aaron Gordon averaging 21 and a half and 10. Damn, we're we this bad. Evans averaged 17. Bamba double double. Simmons 11 off the bench. Isaac 7 8. Okay. That's all right. Uh, we're going to see what he can do next year. Maybe it might be his final year on a leash. I don't know. Uh, points per game, we were sitting at 21. I think we just need to upgrade our bench, to be honest. And a lot of points per game, we were fourth in defense. Um, and then we're going to be sitting at 12th in point differential. So not bad. We definitely have to upgrade the scoring off the bench. We actually won game one by 27. John Wall dropped 40 and 14. Gordon 28. Bamba 18 boards. Okay. Uh, how did Ariza do this year? He's now a 76 overall. He's all right. I didn't end up sending anybody to the G League. That was dumb. I should have at least sent a wound doer foster. Oh, that's an L. All right. Uh, game two. We lost by 11. Tyreek Evans dropped 22. That was a game high, I think. Uh, game three, we're up 2-1. to one. Win by 7. John Wall drops 27-10. and 27-13 for Gordon. Kyrie dropped 30, but it wasn't enough. Game four, they tie it up. All right, we're just going back and forth here. The way this is going, we're going to win this. They'll win the next one. And, okay, no, they're going to win this one. So, they're probably going to win in six. If not, they're going to win in seven. And they win in six. So, the Warriors end up beating Boston in the NBA Finals. Now, it's, it's going to get interesting here because we don't have, like, a top draft pick. We don't really, like, I don't plan on moving Bamba or Gordon at all. Uh, Isaac's got a team option, so I can't even trade him on draft night. Uh, let's go to the draft lottery. And our pick's going to end up being, like, 16 uh, the 17 Washington gets. Nets end up with one. Wizards end up with three, so the rebuilds should be going well. I mean, I don't know if they were smart. They would move Bradley Beal at this point. Bradley Beal's, what, 26, 27? You could still roll with them as your franchise guy. Him and Reddish, I don't know. I guess you're going to play Reddish at the small forward position. And then you got to wait out for Otto's Por Otto Porter's contract to run up. You got one more year left on that, or that was his final year. I don't know. Um, and then 48's got... Yeah, so, like, you draft... Okay, you have a lot... Jesus, shooting guards. Holy crap. Um, yeah, you might want to invest in a big man or two. I was going to give them Vucevic if I was able to sign Vucevic mid-season, but he wants to test. All right, I think I'm going to fire Steve Clifford. I'm going to fire Caleb Smith. Uh, we're going to hire Jacob Underwood. And we're going to hire Trent Peterson. And we're going to roll there with a stud uh, coaching staff. There we go. Uh, I did get a good trainer and assistant GM last offseason, so we're chilling there. So, hopefully that maybe gives us a couple more wins. Alright. Um, Alright, Tyreek Evans is only making, what, 6 mil? Yeah, I'm not going to train him. I think he was a really good player. Worst case scenario, if he could be our starting shooting guard for the remainder of the video. He did average 17 and 5, which is really good. And he shot 44% from the field. Um, obviously, Bomb is going nowhere. He's on a great contract. 
Gordon's honestly on a pretty solid contract. Does it go up? It goes down, actually. He's on a nice contract. And then, obviously, we're paying this man 41 mil a year, which is a lot of money. Okay. So, do we even have a draft pick? We have the first pick in the second round. That's almost the first round pick. Could I move that pick and, like, the 16th pick for, like, 24? Because that's basically, like, a first round pick. And they would be getting another second round pick out of it. No, okay. We'll stick with it. Uh, I'll see you guys in rookie signings. I'll end up drafting someone. All right, uh, best guy we got. Wow, Anthony Edwards. I've heard of him. Uh, we get Herb Jones, 70 overall. Ah, uh, quickly was there? Okay, he's a 72. Whoa! Damn, I should have drafted this guy. Did not know he was that good. And he's only 19. Uh, then with our other pick, we got Nick Ward. Nick Ward. Why does that sound like the guy from Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D.? Ward. His first name definitely wasn't Nick. Crap, I'm not going to know it off the top of my head. What was Ward's first name in... Was his first name Ward? Maybe it was. I don't remember. I haven't watched the show in a little bit. Damn. Okay. No, screw it. All right. Sorry for going off topic here. So, let's go to qualifying offers. We'll see what we do. Honestly, it's not even worth our two mil at this point. So, we should have a little bit of money to play with. We actually do have enough for Max Steel. Uh, I'd be looking at wing players, if anything. Uh, especially... Randall would be cool, but I don't know if I'm open to playing Aaron Gordon at small forward. Like, Siaka would obviously be really cool. Brandon Ingram would be really cool. Like, I could throw a max at him. And then maybe LA's just done with him. They're going to roll with Kuzma. Uh, we could try. We could try. Uh, like, Levert would be really cool, but he's restricted. Probably going to go back. Uh, Jabari Parker might be somewhat of an option. He would definitely help our scoring. He would only cost 16 mil. Damn, Buddy Hill's restricted too. All these guys are... Okay, I might take a shot on him. Just hoping that Brandon Ingram accepts our deal after day one so I can see if they match it or not. Alright, so we're going to read out sorry to everybody. If we don't get him, I think we might go after Jabari Parker. So let's see. Do we get Brandon Ingram? Nope. Damn it. Alright. I feel like I've seen the Lakers give up on him already before. So, ah, uh, damn it. Who's giving him a deal? Trailblazers? Alright, we should definitely be able to match that. I'm going to give you... Jesus, 20 mil, bro. I'm gonna give you a one. I'm gonna give you a, the same deal you got from uh, from uh, Chicago. You're gonna get 20 mil a year. They'll get 21 mil a year with a team option. I don't know. Is he really an upgrade over over uh, Jonathan Isaac? I'm ah, sorry, I can't speak. But he could be a really good six man who could score. All right, I might throw that at him. Let me just make sure there's no other better options. John Henson, oh, okay. A uh, bunch of centers. Dwight Howard. Uh, we do have John Wall. Roberson, but we need offense. So, like, Bazemore could be an option. Trey Wiles wants too much money. Because we're Trier, he wants 12 mil at that. Uh, we do need a backup point card. Like, Napier, Reggie Jackson. What are the odds I can get Jackson as well? On, like, a one-year deal for Reggie Jackson. That provides some good scoring off our bench. Uh, but Jackson and... Who's off the bench originally? Oh, we do need a backup center. Uh, the only person we... We don't have a bench at all. We have one, two, three, four, five. Jesus, we need to sign four dudes. So I don't know if I want to throw all my money at... At Jabari Parker here. Uh, like Serge Ibaka? No, I'm not bringing him back. Ennis Canner. He would provide good offense, but he wants 17 mil. I don't think I'm going to bite all that. Hernan Gomez, he wants 10 mil. JaVale McGee. I might sign for a two-year deal. That uh, would leave us with 28 mil. So we can still side him and, like... Can we side all three of these guys? If we can, that's a dub, I think. I mean, that really doesn't help us out defensively, but we can find somebody else. Let's see. Can we side all three of them? I don't know. Okay. We just got all three of them. Now, I'll, actually, we have, like, 8 mil left. All right. Oh, my God. Let's wrap it off with, like, a Roberson, and let's call it a free agency. Let's wrap it off with a Roberson, and we just actually made some moves. All kind of under-the-radar players... No, Roberson. Ah, oh, you. All right, I'll settle for Avery Bradley. Uh, Avery Bradley can get a two-year deal. Please accept this, Avery. If you don't accept this after your first day, I'll up it. Okay. So we get Avery Bradley, who's pretty much as good as a defender. So we just upgraded a lot. We pick up Reggie Jackson, um, former Thunder and Piston. He'll come off the bench, and up the, like he can provide some great scoring off the bench. Uh, what's his permanent? Need? It's a C minus. Okay. Uh, we did pick up Avery Bradley, who's going to be really good off the bench here for us. Be able to help out Jackson. What is John Wall's permanent? A plus. Okay. 
Uh, we didn't pick up a backup small forward, but that's okay. We didn't pick up Jabari Parker, who is going to come off the bench for us. Uh, I might move him to small forward. His overall will probably go up. Yep. And then we have JaVale McGee, who's also going to be off the bench as well. Uh, what's his? JaVale McGee's inside these. people so it's not that bad. All right. I'll see you guys in training camps. We just made probably our biggest moves in the video besides the John Wall trade. And, yeah, I think that's going to be it with what this team's going to shape out to be. I think it could contend for a championship in the Eastern Conference as long as, like, Bamba develops and Gordon puts up similar production than he did last year. And John Wall carries us. And I think the bench isn't... We just upgraded Augustine to Reggie Jackson, Jonathan Simmons to Jabari Parker, or Jonathan Simmons to... Jonathan Simmons to... What's his name? Jesus Christ. Avery Bradley. Uh... Trevor Ariza to Jabari Parker. Or we okay. We upgraded Simmons to Parker. We upgraded uh Ariza to Bradley. And then we just upgraded uh Moskov to McGee. I think that's a very successful offseason in a Orlando big city, big market, made the first playoffs in a while, and has some promise with a couple young players, an all-star John Wall. I'm gonna send Mo Baba back to the Untap Potential. I'm also gonna send Aaron Gordon there as well. Over Isaac, I know. Uh, Isaac's gonna provide what's Isaac's perimeter D? I'm pretty sure it's like a B plus minimum or it's like a B minimum To be uh, no, it's an A. Okay, so he's an incredible defender I'm kind of tempted rolling him and Bradley out there because then this is an insanely good defensive lineup But now nah, I, I think I want Bradley coming off the bench, but him and Evans are gonna probably play similar minutes Like I think they're both gonna get 25 uh, Yeah, okay, so six man Jamari Parker uh, you can get 25 as well. Reggie Jackson, 19. McGee, 15, I guess. Okay. Uh, Bob is going to get 32. Uh, Isaac, okay. John Wall is going to get probably 35. And then we're going to give the rest to Gordon here. Uh, we'll actually go 31, 33. Uh, yeah, I think that's what we're going to roll with here. So I will see you guys at the end of the season. Why not just... I'll throw him to the Jew League. Uh, so, yeah, that'll be for me. I'll see you guys at the end of the season number two now. And they have us to be the fourth best team in the NBA. That's pretty high praise. All right, guys. So, we go 15-32, which uh, I forgot how many wins we had last year. But I think that's like a seven-win increase. And I think that's all just because of our bench. The Hawks somehow won 60 games. I don't know. They probably signed like KD. No. They probably signed someone, though. I don't know if we're going to get any magic. Obviously, it would probably only be John Wall. And he does not make it. Um, he does make all defensive second team now. That's probably the only award we are going to receive. So, we end up being the three seed, which is nice. I want to see who, uh, no, I didn't want to go that. I want to go here. Who Atlanta signed. They drafted RJ Barrett. They signed Middleton. And they drafted Bull Bowl. Wow. That must have been, like, the Dallas pick and their pick. Or Dallas and Cleveland. Well, now it couldn't have been Cleveland. Yeah, Dallas and their pick. And then maybe they got this from Cleveland. Wow, that's clean. This is a very good team. They don't have a backup. Actually, no, they have no ones as well. Wow, they have a really good team, actually. I would not want to face them. Uh, this team is all right. I mean, they watched Jimmy Butler, so... Yeah, they're a little weak, uh, depth-wise. So, we are taking on... Who wouldn't have one? Four, five, six. Uh, Chicago. Who have Kemba Walker? Zach... Okay, what happened here? Kemba. Uh, Zach Levine. Ryu Hachimura. Markin and Carter. That's pretty filthy. Okay, I'm a little nervous now. That's a good team. That's a pretty stacked Eastern Conference now. Ugh, why? Damn, why was our scoring down? I mean, we had, I don't know. Jeez, it just feels like our scoring was down. 8-8 eight and eight for Isaac is not bad at all. And he's going to play great defense, so I'll take that. Jackson dropped 9.7 off the bench. Bamba with the double-double. Evans with 13 in the starting lineup. Parker with 13 off the bench. I don't know. Is our offense up this year? Uh, not really. It looks like it was down. We were 20th. A lot of points per game, though, we were first and we were third in point differential so we had one of the best defensive teams and we're gonna need it here in this series because we're we won in overtime because we're going up against freaking Levine and Kemba Walker uh and marketed damn it oh, I feel like we're gonna have ourselves an annoying series here I just want to sit with the current round I'm not taking this game by game down two to one two to two uh three to two loss come on pull out pull out pull out let's go baby we win in six that's what I'm talking about and Brooklyn beat Philly okay but recently, I had some rebuilds where Brooklyn beat me in, like, the Eastern Conference Finals. I think it was the Realistic Raptors rebuild, so I don't know what I'm going to get to here. I got Eric Bledsoe. It's such an unnecessary signing for them. Uh, all right. They're 17. We win game one by 10. We held them to 77 points, which is wild. Game two. All right. We're up 2-0. We win by 13. 
Game three. We lost. Game four. Okay, well, now it's 2 2. Great. So that. Ah, oh, Jesus. We were up 32. Please win in six. Please win in six. All right, we're going to a game seven in Orlando. Winners take it on Atlanta, who's probably going to lose anyway. Uh, good first quarter. Good second quarter. Uh, okay, we're only up. How are we only up by one? Damn. Okay, well, we just blew that. Uh, I'll hop in, I guess. Uh, down by five, two and a half minutes. Let's get into this. All right, uh, I'm, uh, when we hop in, I'll just show you guys that I'm on Hall of Fame. Okay, dope. We get the ball. Actually, I always got to double check if I'm on Hall of Fame because I don't know if I remember if I said it when I started. All right. John Wall, I don't get to use a lot, so I'm going to use um, a crazy amount here. Isaac, pick and roll. No, on the other side. Okay. Weird pick and roll. There we go. There we go. Easy money over Russell. Uh, good pass, John Wall. John Wall's got that. actually gives him a double double, 8 and 10. Uh, Bradley, maybe you should keep it just for defense. Gordon's in at center. We got currently Jabari Parker. Jabari Parker's got a B minus permanent That's generous as hell. Uh, John Wall's got probably an A plus, right? Uh, A plus. I'm wow, busy looking at that. I went. Russell score. I gotta realize I'm down by five here. It's not like we're up by anything or it's a tie game. I'm losing. So I need defensive stops galore. Uh, pick and pop with Aaron Gordon. Uh, now nah, we're gonna go straight to the rack. John Wall. Perfect. What are you going to abuse John Wall? I'm only going to abuse John Wall in the pick and roll. We're down by three. Uh, minute 50 left. We need a stop. We need a stop. We need a stop. Come on. Uh, okay, Russell's just going to start dancing here. Good D, good D. Is that Alex out to the Koopo? Okay. They got an interesting team here in Brooklyn. This is game seven, too. I swear, if we really lose to this Nets team, like the net or Nets are becoming my kryptonite, no way Bledsoe hits that. Okay, good board. Uh, Gordon kicking up to Bradley. Uh, I'm really not going to attack with Bradley. Ooh, I kind of want to pull up there. Uh, give me a screen on the left side. There we go. Uh, easy money. I told you I'm going to abuse the pick and roll with John Wall. We're down by one now. Uh, how much time is left? Like 70 seconds? 80 seconds? All right. Let's play some D. A plus steals and A. Oh, I kind of want to go for a steal here. No. How did he keep past me? Okay. Uh, Isaac, get on. Who is that? Alan Williams? A plus D for Isaac, too. No one goes back door. Anthony Edwards on Parker. Probably not the matchup we want. Uh, I think he was a highly talented rookie. No way. Yes, let's go. How did he get that board? Get the block. Okay, he missed that. Uh, let's kick it up. Let's go. Let's go. Let's push it. Isaac, come on, Isaac. Go straight to the rack here. And one. Okay, he's going on the line. I don't know how he's a free throws, but I just need you to hit one. And we're actually getting our subs in. First one is up. And good. All right, so tie game. Next one will put us up if he hits it. Of course, he's going to miss it because that's just how 2K is. All right, well, we have a tie game on our hands. Jesus Christ. Get on the vert. Get on the vert. Good D, good D, good D. Oh my god, get a block. Oh my god, I love you, Tyreek. I love you, Tyreek. Kick it a job ball. Let's go. Let's go. Bomba, roll. Mm, you should have. Okay, okay. Kick it. No, oh, that was risky. Uh, Isaac, please make, make that. You're literally two feet away from the basket. Jesus Christ, can you never shoot a basketball to save your life? All right, everyone get. Yo, dude, the transition defense in this game is so annoying. Get it to John Wall. Okay, let me move my tripod here so I can see the shot clock. We got 19 seconds or 17 seconds left on the shot clock. I'm going ISO pick and roll here. ISO pick and roll. Aaron Gordon, John Wall. Okay, of course they play good D. Out to Tyree. Tyree, please. Come on. That was near perfect. How do you miss that? How do you miss that, bro? You were wide open. Apparently not trying to go to OT just to get swept next series by Atlanta. Oh, my God. How does he miss that? I, don't, I can't tell you. I literally cannot tell you how he missed that. Oh, Tyreek, Tyreek. All right. Uh, you probably should have put our defense in the lineup. In. Damn, Bamba is 23 and 15. Isaac on Edwards. This is, like, it right here. Good D. Oh, call time out. Ah, okay. Well, good D there by Isaac. As we're going to OT, like I usually do, I'm just going to sim right to the last, like, minute of OT. Hopefully, it's not a blowout. Hopefully, it's so close. So it'd be fun to play. But, yeah, I feel like no matter what happens in this series, we're going to get swept by Atlanta's god team of... Or cool, they have a cool team in Atlanta. Like Bull Bull, Ryu Hachimura, Trey Young, RJ Barrett. That's really good. So let me simcast this real quick. Or when can I? Uh, can I simcast it now? There we go. All right. So let's simcast this down. Don't blow this, boys. Okay, we got a three-point lead. Tie game. Now we're down by two. Up by one. Okay, back and forth. Do not go down by three here. Can we score? Can we score? Jesus Christ, can we score? There we go. Someone hit a three. Now we're by five. Now we're by eight. All right, we're winning this game. Let's go. All right, we're moving on to the next round. Thank God we just beat Brooklyn. If, if we lost to Brooklyn there, I don't know. I would have been really upset. I can't believe Tyreek Evans missed that three. He could have sent us home in evacuation, and I would have been able to boast a little bit. But, yeah, we're taking on Atlanta. I'm expecting to get swept after all that. But, hey, maybe we'll pull off an upset because it's just literally a 17-seeded Warriors and a 5-seeded Nuggets. Warriors still got Curry and KD and Jerry Mamba. They don't have Clay. 
All right, let's see. Game one. Okay, lost by six. Not a good start. Game two. Um, F off, bro. Uh, I, I didn't actually want to get swept. All right, two to one. We win this one in Orlando. Can we please tie it up? Nah, we're going to go down three to one. Okay, okay. Please, can we go up three to two? Can we win three and answer? That would be nuts. This would be nuts. On the road, though, this is a tough one. Not a good second quarter. Uh, we're not winning this game. All right. We got to win two now, unanswered. One in Orlando, one back in Atlanta. All right, can we win this game, please? All right, not a good first quarter, not a good second quarter, and we're going to get blown out. Wonderful. So I'll see you guys in the offseason, and we'll go into the third and final season. Damn, this might be a long bit. Actually, no, that's probably not. Atlanta wins it all, and RJ Barrett is your finals MVP. Go figure. Uh, yeah, so let's go to lottery here. Uh, we are going to be picking at... Jeez, we even have 26. Wizards at four. Hey, dude, that's your like third lottery pick in a row. That's how you start a rebuild. Uh, let's go to, I actually want to see how they're doing. Because they have the fourth pick. They had, I don't know, they had a high pick last year. I think they had like three last year. Who did they take? James Wiseman. Okay, that's what you, that's what I'm talking about, bro. Draft a point guard here and call it a, a rebuild. And then you have cast space because Porter and 40's contracts are up. So what do we have? 26. Honestly, I think I'm just going to keep the team as the same. I might even bring back Jamari Parker. I like. I could let him walk. How did Jerry Foster progress? Well, Jerry Foster might be a free agent because, I don't know. I might let him walk and then like look to bring him back. Uh, so I'm going to bring back these two, these two. He accepts the player option. Cool. I'm going to bring him back anyway. Do I want to bring back Jamari Parker? Screw it. We're just going to We were two games away from going to the NBA Finals, and I thought we would have definitely won it if we made it. So we are going to just bring back everybody. Including Jonathan Isaac, even if it's going to cost me max deal. Because I believe this will be the final year. Any crazy unrestricted free agents? You got Tobias. Going to go back to the Clippers, though. Uh, Steven Adams, cool, but we did need a setter. Uh, all restricted. Willie Corey Stein, don't need a setter. Aldridge, interesting, but don't need a big man. Uh, Jay Rich. That would have been cool. That would have been a cool addition. Not going to lie. Over... Damn, he's still not upgraded though. Like usually, I would say, yeah, I would see him dropping like 18 a game just based off what he's balling out of real life. Chris Dunn unrestricted, but we can't afford anybody here. So because we brought back Jabari Parker, it's all right though. Let's offer Isaac. Jesus Christ, we're gonna pay him 30 mil. Well, basic. Oh, Reggie Jackson's a free agent. Shoot, I would like to bring back Reggie. Did he sign? Damn, are we not gonna be able to bring him back? Uh, damn, did he sign already? No, he did. Okay. Uh. Okay, hold on. This is glitching now. Uh, I do want to get a point guard. Could we get, like, a Beverly instead of a Reggie Jackson? I would take that. Uh, all right, we're going to get Isaac back for an eye because this game is stupid. And we get Isaac and Beverly. So, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, Parker's still going to come off the bench. Evans is probably still going to start over Bradley. And we just, I guess, I don't know if we upgraded. I mean, a Bradley, now I kind of want to start Bradley. And then we can have, yeah, I'm probably going to start Bradley now over uh, Evans because we added Beverly on the bench. All right, this team was two games away from winning the finals last year. Let's hope we can do the same. I did set on 10 potential to actually Isaac and Baba. Baba's at 88, which is pretty sweet. So Bradley is 77. I feel like that's a little disrespectful. But we're going to go 25 to Bradley. We're going to go 35 to Wall. We're going to go 32 there. 32, 32. We'll fix that maybe. Uh, we're gonna go, Jesus, uh, yo, I forgot JaVale McGee left, oh no, he just regressed a little bit, okay, JaVale's gonna get like, 14, we're gonna go 7, 16 to Evans, we're gonna go 20, we're gonna go 25 there, uh, I got 9 minutes left, so let's go, let's see, 34, 37, 34, 34. Yeah, we're going to play those guys a lot. And then I got one more minute here. We'll give it to Evan. So that's going to be for me. I'll see you guys at the end of the season. They have us with the third best team. Fourth. Please, let's win it all this year. We were two games away from just going to it last year. All right, in the final season, we top off or top off with 57 wins. One game away from the one seed, it looks like. Maybe John Wall got it on his final year. DeAndre Aiden make it all be first team. Dude, did average it. Oh, my God. Dude's a stud. I'll be second team. Ben Simmons is here. Zion Williamson. I'll be third team. Luka Doncic. Killing it. RJ Barrett. Killing it. We're going to probably see him in the playoffs. Uh, John Wall. All defensive first team. And that's all we're going to get. He back. Okay. He was back into 20 points a game. Almost 22. 7.8. Very similar 
to uh, his first year in Orlando. Uh, sorry if this wasn't, like... I mean, obviously, I kept the core of, like, obviously, John Wall when we traded for him, uh, Isaac, Gordon, and Bobo, but I did side a lot of bench players that I feel like maybe became a little bit unrealistic, and I didn't build through the draft as much. So I do apologize for that if that did grind your gears a little bit. Uh, we're taking on Boston in round one. I don't know. Boston sucks in 2K, so I'm not really that worried. Gordon back in a 28 game. You like to see it. Double-double for Baba. Parker, 13 and a half off the bench. There's Evans, Isaac, Bradley, and Beverly. I'm very positive we had to be like the best score, uh, defensive team in the league. Uh, still 20th in offense, but defense by far the best. And we actually had the best point differential. So we are the two seeds, so we wouldn't have to face Atlanta until the conference finals like last year. Oh, okay, of course they say Boston's bad, and then we lost game one, and we're down two to one. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Oh my god. Yep, alright, well, this video was an L. I made it, the furthest I made it was the conference finals, it was two games away. Of course they say Boston sucks in 2K, and then they end up beating me in five. So, we'll see, and then they go get swept, or they lose in five to Boston. Atlanta's probably going to go back to back. I don't see them losing again. Damn. All right. Well, John Wall cannot bring Orlando a title. Uh, ooh, okay. Philly might be. Okay, Philly goes to the finals. All right. Uh, why couldn't the three seed last year go to the finals and Denver wins it all? Jokic is your finals MVP. Okay. Well, that's going to be for me. Thank you for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy. We could not win a title with this team. We did make it to the conference finals, though. But we know what realistic rebuild you would want to see next or just a trade scenario rebuild like this. And I combined the two, really. So uh, I did just feel Because I think when I did my Marco Fultz magic rebuild, I made it fantasy style. So I kind of wanted to do a realistic one. Sorry for signing Jamar Parker if you hated that signing. Or I like the, Bar the Bradley signing, but if you. Didn't like the Beverly signing or the Tyreek signing or the McGee signing. I don't know. Let me know. So that'll be for me. Thank you for watching, though. I love you guys. Hope you guys enjoy. Uh, I'm about to walk into my legal studies final, so I'm freaking out a little bit. Uh, so, yeah, wish me luck. I'll see you guys next video. Peace.